Hi, this is AJ from WPExplorer.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create full width uh, background areas using the total WordPress theme. So right here, I just have a very simple uh, basic page with nothing on it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add in a new row using the Visual Composer. And then all you need to do to create a section with a background is click this edit button here for the row. And under the background tab, you can give it a background. So for example, I'm going to give it a black background. And I'm just going to choose just a ran any random image. Let's say this one. And under here, I can choose if I want stretch, fixed, parallax, or repeat. I'll just leave it for stretch. Now if I update the post, you won't see anything because basically it's an empty row. So I'm just going to go ahead and add a text block just with some, just the standard basic text. And update that. Now when I refresh the page, you're going to see I have this row now with some, some text that's hardly visible. So to make it full screen, I'm going to have to remove the sidebar. And that's very simple. Well, of course, remove the sidebar and stretch it out to the edge. So all you need to do is right here under the page settings, for the page layout, select full screen. Now when I do that, you'll see when I refresh the page, now my row goes all the way across. That's cool. So this looks pretty bad, of course. So I'm going to go ahead and do some tweaks. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the, the title. So if you scroll down, you can either remove the title or you can just disable the margin underneath it. If you disable the margin, it'll get rid of this space here. I'm just going to go ahead and disable the, the whole title. Now for my row, if I go under design, there's this option here to center the content. If you look at if you look at it, you can see the text goes all the way across. So, well, it doesn't go all the way across because there's not enough, but it's not centered. So I can check this to center it. Now under the padding option, I can give it some padding. So I'm just going to give it some top and bottom padding. Because it's centering the content, I don't need the left and right padding. Now back under design, I can scroll down a bit and I can choose a white text typography style for this row. And so that'll make any text inside the row white. So that'll be useful. Now I'm going to save this and I'm just gonna go ahead and make my text just a little bit bigger. Yeah. So if you don't see this option right here just make sure you've toggled it right there and I'll go ahead and center it. Now when I save and refresh my page you'll see the title is gone. I've got some nice padding, I got a full width background and here's my text in the center. Of course this isn't a very pretty example but it shows you how easy it is to set up these full screen backgrounds um, with the total theme and the Visual Composer plugin.